Hi, Christopher. Today we're going to work on your letters using the wet, dry, try method. So at home, I don't know if you have a chalkboard or not at home, but if you have a chalkboard, that would be the best thing to use. I have a little one here. It doesn't really matter the size of it. Um, or if you don't have a chalkboard, you could use the whiteboard. Or if you don't have a whiteboard, we can just use paper. That would be okay. Or another, actually another idea is if you have sidewalk chalk, you could do this outside on the sidewalk. So we're, I'm gonna show you using this, but there's lots of ways to modify it at home. So the wet, dry, try method, we're first gonna do letter L. And I'm gonna put the computer down so you can see what I'm doing here. And I'm gonna use the verbiage from the Handwriting Without Tears program. So I'm gonna say, in this part, you're gonna have a grown-up do. So your mom or dad or whatever grown-up is helping you do this. So you're gonna do big line, little line. So the grown-up is going to do that, and then Christopher is going to take, now, depending on what you have at home, you might have, if you have a sponge, you cut a little piece off the sponge and use that, because the littler it is, the more it works those little muscles in the hand. So you can use a sponge. If you don't have a sponge to use, just get a wet paper towel. That'd be fine, too. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to trace it, and I'm going to do big line, little line. So that's our wet part. And then to dry it, I'm going to get paper towel, Kleenex, whatever you have at home. I'm going to dry it, following it again, big line, little line. And now it's Christopher's turn to try it. So then he's going to try doing big line, little line. And he might need some help with this. Um, you could, so the grown up could be holding the chalk, and then Christopher could hop on. Or he could be holding it and you, the grown-up could provide hand-over-hand -hand assistance. Um, and I do have a littler piece of chalk here because that's better, like I said, with the sponge to use the little, work the little muscles in the hand. So there is the L. And then I'm going to erase it. We're going to start over and do a new letter now. So the next letter we're going to do, so the grown-up does this part, we're going to do letter F. So F is a big line, little line little line. Now it's Christopher's turn to grab the sponge, the wet sponge, or the wet paper towel. Big line, little line, little line. Good. And then Christopher again will take the, the dry paper towel or Kleenex. Big line, little line, little line. And now it's Christopher's turn to try it. So big line, little line, little line. Very good. So there's letter F. We're going to erase that and move on to the next letter. So basically this whole time the grown-up the grown-up is writing it at first and then Christopher is going to do all the rest. So the wetting, the drying, and then he's going to try it with the chalk. So our next letter is E. So E is a big line, little line, little line, little line. So next we're going to wet it Big line, little line, little line, little line. And we're gonna dry it. Big line, little line, little line, little line. And then it's time to try it. Big line, little line, little line, little line. Very good, so there's letter E. I'm gonna erase it all, move on to the next letter. Next letter is letter H. So with letter H, we're going to do big line, big line, little line. We're going to take our wet sponge or paper towel, big line, big line, little line. Very good. And then we're going to dry it. Big line, big line, little line. Now time to try it. Big line. Big line, little line. Very good, then we're gonna erase it. We have one more letter to do. And that letter is letter T. So letter T is, now this is the grown ups do again. Big line, little line. Very good, and then wet sponge. Big line, little line. We're gonna dry it. Big line. Little line, and now it's Christopher's turn to try. Big line, little line. Very good, so there's letter T. So those are um, the first couple letters of the Handwriting Without Tears program, which is a program that helps you 
learn how to write letters and gives you different language to use. So we're gonna um, keep practicing, okay, Christopher? I hope you're doing good at home. We miss you. Bye.